Welcome to another edition of SwageLock Tech Clips, bite-sized training and fluid system best practices. In this video, we will review the three steps involved in installing a SwageLock tube fitting and two of the most common installation errors. SwageLock tube fittings come to you completely assembled finger tight, ready for immediate use. Avoid disassembling the tube fittings prior to installation. The following instructions apply to SwageLock tube fittings from quarter inch or six millimeters to one inch or 25 millimeters. Step one, fully insert the tube into the fitting and against the shoulder. Rotate the nut to make sure it is finger tight. Step two, mark the nut at the six o'clock position. Step three, while holding the fitting body steady, tighten the nut one and one quarter turns to the nine o'clock position and the job is done. That's all there is to it. Two of the most common installation errors are, number one, not fully inserting the tube into the fitting and making sure it rests firmly against the shoulder of the fitting body. Number two, relying on feel instead of the one and one quarter turn from finger tight instructions. Following these simple installation instructions will prevent these errors, eliminate the variables involved in an installation by feel, and ensure sufficient pull up and a leak tight seal on every installation. For a more detailed explanation on tube fitting installation, watch the SwageLock Tech Tip video tube fitting assembly one inch and under. Thanks for watching this SwageLock Tech Clip. To get a more complete understanding of fluid system best practices, consider attending our in-person training courses.